All right, this is the, the bridge I saw after I walked through downtown this morning. We're gonna go across it. And it's just a walking bridge. It looks like it has plants on both sides. Are there more plants? I don't know. Why don't you eat them and find out? They might even be poisonous. There's like, this is like an arsenal museum. They have tours. Yeah, this is the whole thing is like a museum, an arsenal museum. It's got all, it's like a, basically like a park here. I don't know, we we'll have to look at the signs, but let's look at the bridge. Yeah, I don't know what that is. There's daffodils here on the bridge. It's got bricks here. Yeah, I only saw this because I was walking on that bridge over there and I looked over here. You don't normally notice this. Alright, and on this side, on the left, is the Museum of the Cape Fear and the Edgar Allan Poe House. That's what it says. I guess that one on the... Actually, I'm not sure which is which. This might be the Edgar Allan Poe House. There's a sign here. Alright, I think that's the Edgar Allan Poe House right there. And that's the museum on the left, I think. Or maybe not, I don't even know. I feel like we're walking right into somebody's backyard. Maybe that's the Edgar Allan Poe House, I have no idea. All right, this is the Poe House, it says, right here. This is the Poe House. All right, we're gonna try to walk around front. All right, here's the Museum of the Cape Fear, Cape Fear Historical Complex. North Carolina Arsenal. This is all part of the arsenal, I guess. And then, so that's the museum, and that's the Edgar Allan Poe House over there. So it says E.A. Poe was a Fayetteville businessman. Is that the same person? Edgar Allan Poe? Is it, or is this a different one? I don't even know. It says it's closed. Look, the porch wraps around one side. You can see it's got a balcony up on top of the porch. Looks like working shutters. I don't know if they actually move or not. Oh, yeah, yeah, I guess they do. And this, this is chained off. That's a really weird sunset. There are some a line of storms moving in. That is a, actually the clouds coming from the west. So we need to hurry up and get back. 
You can see they put a new roof on this building in the back. Look at the weird sunset behind that cloud. It's like behind a storm cloud. The sun's just po the sunset just poking out. The rest of it's all covered in storm clouds. All right, we're gonna see what this is. These are crepe myrtles. There's four on each side. They, look, they probably look pretty nice in the warm months. So this is like Civil War, I guess. Right? Yes. So U.S. troops destroyed the, civ the Confederate arsenal. I guess that's what it was. That's what's left of the house. It's a stone foundation. Here's what's left of this one. Oh, there's not much left of this. This is a park. No excavating. All right. I don't know if these are part of the museum, Arsenal Museum, I think it is. The yeah, Arsenal House. And Davis House. See, all this is here, we didn't even know. And this is, I'm guessing this is probably the museum building right here. Cause it's got like a disabled access ramp on it. The two parking spots, but no driveway. I'm guessing this is a museum, but it says Culbreth House. Okay, so what do you think? Boring? You're yawning? No, Arsenal? Small. I'm just... Arsenal and Edgar Allan Poe, yeah. right? We went to two museums that were both closed. <laughs> yeah. Maybe Saturday we yeah. can go at yeah, but... 10 a.m. Oh, I doubt they're open actually. It's during COVID-19, I think everything shut down. Po, the Poe House said masks required. It did? Yes. Oh. Okay. All right. You can bring masks. Yeah.